Alejandro Davidovich Fakina versus Alexander Zverev is the first quarterfinal for the Men's French Open for 2021. And both these players have had to fight to get to the quarterfinal stage. Fakina came into the tournament as an unseeded player and had to play Kukushkin in the first round, getting through in three sets, 6-4, 6-4, 6-3. His second round opponent was the qualifier, Van der Zandschul. And after winning the first two sets, he had to fight in five, eventually prevailing 6-4, 6-4, 5-7, 2-6, 6-4. His third round opponent was in form Norwegian and the 15th seed Casper Rudd. And again, Fakina had to fight in an epic battle, prevailing in another four and a half hour five set match. 7-6, 2-6, 7-6, love 6, 7-5. His fourth round opponent was another unseeded player, Del Bonis, who'd been very impressive this week also. But Fakina looked solid and eventually prevailed in four. 6-4, 6-4, 4-6, 6-4. Alexander Zverev entered the tournament as the number six seed, starting with the qualifier in the first round. And after dropping the first two sets, Sasha had to fight to come back to win in five. 3-6, 3-6, 6-2, 6-2, 6 love. His second round was another qualifier, Sefulin, who put up a big fight against Verev in a couple of the sets, but as Verev eventually prevailed in three, 7-6, 6-3, 7-6. His third round was against Serbian clay quarter Jera, and even though the second set was tight, Verev prevailed in straight sets again, 6-2, 7-5, 6-2. His fourth round opponent was a dangerous one in Kei Nishikori. And these two had played twice already on the clay, with Zverev winning both. And this was no different, with Zverev playing his best match of the tournament, winning in straight sets 6-4, 6-1, 6-1 to advance to the quarterfinals. These two have actually played a couple of times before with Zverev leading the head-to-head 2-0. -head Both of those matches happening last year and Fakina not winning a set. But their last match was very close and they've never actually played on clay, which you would expect Fakina would like better than on the hard courts that they played last year. But for Fakina to win, he's going to have to be aggressive and make Zverev move. And he's probably going to have to play these quick points because he's played some five setters along the way and his legs will be tired. If Zverev's going to win, he's going to have to serve well and the ground strokes have to be working as well. He's going to have to be patient as well because we we know that Fakina, he loves to run side to side, but the longer this match goes on, the more it favors Zverev. I'm going to go with Zverev to win this one in straight sets. I just think Fakina, he's played a great tournament to the quarterfinals, but he's played too many five set matches and his legs will be feeling it. Whereas Zverev, he just blew through his last match against Nishikori. So I'm expecting Zverev to win this one in straight sets, but let me know down in the comments below. Who do you think is going to win?